Now and welcome to this new video of Halo Reach. <laughs> hey, Duke, we Oh boy, one of them is a rocket launcher. That's gonna hurt. The fucking grenades! I swear to god. It's okay, I'm dead already. Hey, so squishy. That was good. Why did it stop aiming? Who's Ben? Well, I don't know. I don't Ben. Unless we're, we're talking about Ben 10. But I don't think we're talking about Ben 10. I'm pretty sure this game came out way before Ben 10. But I'm fairly sure. Ooh, that hurts! No, I don't copy. Usually I try to do original work. Usually. If it looks like I'm copying, it's just that I found out that your stuff was really good and I'm like, I like it. I really like it. Consider it a mirage. Why do you have two good weapons? Did he just insta switch at the end? You know, I wish the AI wasn't better at this game than me. Because they got more resistance than me, so they don't need to be better at this game than me. They already had an advantage. They got more of everything. They got infinite ammo, for fuck's sake. I don't. Taking that. Well, why do I even take it? Apparently, I'm like. Sorry, Carl, I'm cruising. No! no. Wait, that's not where you fell. You fell the other way. Fuck. Wait. Wait, 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 no. I'm just gonna do that because. Okay. Boom. Boom. I thought you could like shoot from the ladder. Ah, yes, uh, we go.
This is fairly easy. Wait. Where was Emil in this? Because he got hit and taken out of something that was like elongated. This is clearly not the cabin I'm shooting from. So where the fuck was he? Wait, this makes no sense. Was I supposed to shoot this? Maybe I was supposed to shoot this. Uh whoops. Cruiser moving into position. I need it dead. Turn one, hey. Okay, got him. Good gun, Spartan. It looks All like they're shipping me. Right for I don't know which one, but it looks like one of them. <laughs> I don't think it's Samus' ship. No, Samus' ship is like. Not like that. Actually, maybe it looks like a ship from Met Zero. Um. Could even be Kirby, actually. Something Nintendo. <laughs> I did it! I saved Cortana! I mean, that ending was kind of spoiled because, I mean, uh, I know I completed my mission because we literally got Cortana as our Windows 10 Alpha. Oh, let's do a little bit too for So what does my character do now? And we are with Bang. We come to reach. So that was the final mission! Jesus. Cortana, all I need to know is, did we lose them? I think we both know the answer to that. Is that yes or no? I'm guessing that's a yes, but who's them? Oh, the Covenant. The Halo. I don't even know what the Halo is. All I know is that it looks like the Citadel in Mass Effect. That's pretty much it. Lone Wolf. Bad Reach. Oh, that's why he's called Halo Reach. Wait. 
So it's just a planet colonized by people, by um, humankind? But that was in Hungary? That was just Hungarians, an Hungarian colony on it? Hmm. Oh fuck off! <laughs> There'll be another time. Uh, yeah, I'll die. That's it. Thank you. Oh well, thank god for the shittiest guns. Where do I even go? Oh, okay. So this is the mission in which I just died, basically. So this mission is gonna be fast. Where, where am I? I don't know how much ammo I have. But I want to leave. <laughs> Let me leave. Oh fuck! I got no ammo. Where's the rest of the enemies? There they are. I gotta say the final mission there. That's some good shit. Reminds me of the final mission in uh, Final Fantasy Crisis Squad. Or was it Crisis Squad? Uh, beautiful final mission. What the fuck? Okay, I'm dead. Oh, is he going in Kimbo in the end? I wish I could have done that. Did I literally fight over who could kill me? How does that work? There were two holes in my head. 
helmet. It didn't take long for Reach to fall. Our enemy was ruthless, efficient, but they weren't nearly fast enough. For you had already passed the torch, and because of you, we found Halo, unlocked its secrets, shattered our enemy's resolve. Our victory, your victory, was so close. I wish you could have lived to see it. But you belong to Reach. Your body, your armor, all burned and turned to glass. Everything, except your courage. That you gave to us, and with it, we can rebuild. Oh, so basically, the Covenant wanted Cortana to find the Halo? And we got Cortana and we passed it further, and because of it we found the Halo? And then we won, I guess? I mean, I guess not, because it's still Halo 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Wow, no credits? Okay. Uh, okay, fine. I guess no credits. Well, <laughs> honestly, though, I can't say it's a great game. That kind of was, um, aside from the, like, final mission, um, kind of was underwhelming. Wait, weren't we five? It was like Emil, Cat, Carter, George, and me. Emil, Cat, Carter, George, and me. Yeah, that's five. Where's. Well, I guess there's not number six on it. No, six. Oh, well. So, uh, time for a final note on this game. Um, sound design. Like I said, really lacking, like, not that great. There's a lot of problem, like, the guns sound, like, they're muffled throughout the whole fucking game. It's so weird. Like, the guns don't sound good. The soundtrack is great. Uh, the voice acting, <laughs> kind of like in Shenmue, you can hear the background noise. Kind of like in my, uh, in my, um, microphone. If you really focus on it, you can hear it. Which is usually something you can't hear in most games. In this one you can, that's really, really odd. I don't know if it's a uh, fault of the um, remaster, or if it's also in the original. So that, that kind of suck. The, but like I said, the soundtrack is beautiful. Some great song choices, I liked it. Graphically, it aged. The game aged. Okay, even in the enhanced version, it's it looks old. It looks old. But it does have moments where it looks really beautiful. And artistically, the game is beautiful. The artistic direction is perfect. Gameplay? I can't complain. The gameplay is great. The gameplay is really good. It's a good gunplay. No problem with that. Maybe my only complaint is you can't aim downside for most weapons, which kind of sucks. But it's an old game. Most old games didn't allow to do that. But it's still weird to like being able to zoom, even though it's not zoom and shoot. It's, it's, except on some weapons, it is. It, it's odd. Um, I wish the game had more options though, as in, like the Master Chief Collection. I wish it had more options, because the graphical options are like, heavily lacking. Thank god there's no motion blur, because I would have been fucking pissed. But yeah, like, what what the fuck kind of options were those? That kind of sucks. But I'm noting, um, Halo Reach more than the Master Chief Collection right now. In terms of story, 
like I said, the problem with the audio is like most of the time I couldn't understand what the characters were saying. So I had no fucking clue what the characters were saying, so that's great. So I had a really hard time actually following the story while I was playing. Maybe people watching had a better time following with the story, but I didn't. And I feel like not many people had a really easy time following because I was commentating. And really huge lack of subtitles. Why? I enabled the subtitles and it's only in the cutscenes. Like, there's a lot of radio talk during the fucking gameplay. Give me some fucking subtitles for this shit, please. Because some of them have a really heavy accent and I can hardly understand them, especially with radio effects. Like, it's not that easy to understand what they're saying. Let's see, I know the gameplay, art style, graphical, graphics, um, sound. I think that's about it. In length, though, wow. I can't believe this game used to be $60. <laughs> Some people paid $60 for a six hours campaign. Wow. <laughs> I mean, I guess they also play, paid this price for like mostly playing online, but still, six hours campaign. That's barely above what Call of Duty gives you. That's really not a lot. But I guess it's fine. For that kind of uh, game in which like most of the um, most of the missions don't really connect narratively. Like I don't feel like there was a narrative that connected every single mission. I feel like most of the missions were kind of like the same missions in a Call of Duty game, for example, like, okay, your mission is there now, okay, now your mission is there. You, It still kind of works narratively because you're a soldier and shit, but it's not the normal narrative, like, it's not fluid, like, in other kind of games. But it works, I guess. It's not that bad. But since it's not the kind of shit I usually go for, I'm thankful that I only pay 40 bucks for this game and five other games to come so thank god I didn't pay too much for this so um, can I recommend Halo Reach it's not a chore it's not a really bad game but it's not amazing so yeah I can recommend you playing it but I don't feel like it's that amazing of a game. The ending is a really powerful mission. But I feel like thank god I actually tried to survive a bit because I would have died really fucking fast because you die really fucking fast in this game. It's like why do you die so fucking quickly when the enemies take so many fucking bullets to die? And you run out of bullets so fucking often it's so annoying. Anyway, final verdict, I can recommend the game, I can highly recommend the Master Chief Collection, that's for sure. Fucking 40 bucks for 6 games, why wouldn't you? Especially, like, I feel like the online is gonna be the most important part of those games. So, for me it's mostly the campaign, but for most people, you'll have way worth your money. Don't worry about that. So, final verdict. Sadly, not a really high note, just a little bit above average. This game gets a 13 out of 20 for me. Not that great, but it's still a bit above average. And I feel like if there's a few fixes that could like fix that. In downside, uh, actual better audio controls. Fucking subtitles for the radio talk because I couldn't fucking understand anything that was said. Mm, I don't think that's about it. Maybe a better time to kill for the enemies. Like, I die way faster than any one of them. Even those small fucking pieces of shit. They die way harder than me. And on normal, I don't think like that should be normal. 
Anyway, thank you all so much for watching this series of video on Halo Reach. I'll see you next time, in the next video of, of course, Halo 1, because it takes place after Halo Reach. Thanks for watching, see you next time, bye!